all, this is brand new for me. I have never done a video on YouTube before. I hope you really enjoy this tutorial. It is a gift for my mother. And what you will be needing today is six of these candlesticks that you can purchase at the Dollar Tree. You will need one medium sized bowl at the Dollar Tree, which at there it's the large. Um, it's more medium size. And then we also need, you'll need one of these size, and then you will need two of these small bowls. You will also be needing two of these tea light candles, which we will be gluing together. You will need your bling wrap. You can find it on Amazon. Um, they have some uh, different kinds. It's kind of it's the same thing carried at Michaels, Amazon, uh, Dollar Tree. I've never actually seen it at my Dollar Tree, um, but at the Dollar Trees, I guess they look more like this. I got this one at Michaels long time ago. Um, I think I only paid a dollar for it. I paid two dollars for this and you will need your E6000. E6000 here and my other one right here. This one is for doing larger projects. This one's for jewelry so they have a tight little tight little edge that you can put on. Make sure to get clear. I accidentally bought White. And I had to go back to Walmart, unfortunately, to get the clear. And thank God they had it because I wouldn't be doing this. And I'm not sure if I'm going to be using it yet. Um, I have this. You've already seen the picture. You probably already know if I've used it yet. But um, I have this metallic spray. And I also have this glitter blast diamond dust spray. They are both by Krylon. You need the E6000 to hold your glass pieces together. It is very critical that you use such a strong glue or else they are going to fall apart and break. Um, I also found two at Walmart that I had never seen before. These. They are strands of bling that are already, they're stickers and they glue together. I don't know how well you can see that. This for these. And this is the other size. They also have, this is the smaller size medium and they also have a larger size. You will need your glue gun. Always need your glue gun. Uh, glue gun is not strong enough to hold the glass together but it will help with jewels and stuff like that. And you can use the E6000 for the jewels too. Also comes in handy when you're doing these types of projects to have a leveler. So that's that. Let's get started. So the first thing I'm doing is cleaning the glass on the rims and inside. So first, I am going to apply some glue to the rim. So this is 
what I have done so far. I have the two candlesticks glued together. I have to wait 24 hours for them to be completely dry. I have these, this right here, these two glued, glued together. I did not use any of the hot glue, so it is a little too soon for me to finish up with these. So I'm gonna go ahead and let that dry overnight and I will finish that in the morning. It has been about 24 hours, so everything is completely dry. This would not have stayed at all yesterday if I shook it. I mean, you don't wanna keep doing it, but. Anyways, I went ahead while the camera was off and I applied some of these beads, the small ones from Walmart and I just wrapped them right around. And then I also started lining them up down the lines here. If you can see it, down the lines and across here. I'm gonna go ahead and do the tops. This is where the, the small bowls are going to fit. And then I'm gonna start decorating with my diamond wrap right around here. And we'll just see how things go. I'm still, I still have ideas in my head about what to do with these bowls. We are going to figure out. comment section did you buy it that I was scared or did you not buy it leave a comment thanks and is it real or I no. already know it's not real as I was doing this project I decided that I needed some more bling that I had not purchased before so I headed to Michael's and I found this right here. This, this was five ninety nine, and I got used my fifty percent off coupon at Michaels. And this is four ninety nine, and I used my fifty percent off coupon. And I went ahead and purchased this also from Michaels. It was a dollar ninety nine. It's whole car paint. Uh, sequin silver is the color. It's silver paint with glitter on it. So now I'm going to take my masking tape. I did not know I was going to be doing this these bowls this way in the beginning. My mind is constantly changing on what exactly I'm going to do. And then I will also be using rubber bands. So here we go. Just kind of have to figure it out however I want to do it. it it's not going to be perfect. Every bowl is going to be a little different. So I'm just going to wing it.
off camera, I did the inside, the gold shimmer dust, the diamond dust, and I did a little bit of the diamond dust on the outside, and then I also went over and sprayed the outside with the silver, and I did two coats of silver and just one coat of the diamond dust. Yes, I will be removing these. Now it's time to go ahead and glue the last pieces together. I will do this right now and add the bling and along with everything else off camera. And I will be back shortly. the bling two rows of the diamond wrap and I'm going to finish this one I just need my E6000 and I will place the glue along the edges some bling around. I, what I did was a double row around here I, and then also here I there's four rows so I had two here and the double here and that way I could push them together so they're not far apart they hid the gap so it makes that look really pretty. So then all I have to do is glue these on and that's that hi i'm melissa gordon thank you for watching my tutorial i hope you enjoyed it if so please like it and comment on anything you'd like um, ask a question i'd love to answer all your questions or just simply state whether you liked it disliked it or how you'd like to do it yourself and if you haven't already, please subscribe. There will be more videos on the way. Please check out my blog at honeybeeadored.com. And we hope to see you next time. See you later. Honey be adored. Honey be adored. Honey be adored. Honey be adored.